Hey y'all, special unplanned video. Just because I woke up this morning to like five messages from guys on Tinder. Um, all within the hours between like 12 a.m. and two. Let me tell you about a little something called booty call hour. I do not answer messages from dudes I do not know after, in fact, after 10 o'clock, hell no. Unless you're trying to confirm if we're still on for tomorrow, sure. But if you're trying to set something up now, booty call hour. I think that's gonna be a whole video, but let me tell y'all about booty call hour. Booty call hour is that time frame that, you know, usually a person you have not quite hit it off with, you know, on dating sites or even in text messages. You know, you might get someone's phone number. Um, they start messaging you in the late nights, asking what you're doing. And so booty call hour is fine for some people that understand that is my booty call person and like I'm up when they're up. But when you just, when you're not for it, it becomes interesting because one guy has been hitting me up almost all week during booty call hour and I don't answer, <laughs> don't. And in fact, I've been going to bed pretty early, but he has the audacity to say, I've been trying to talk to you all week and you ain't answering. Because you up when the demons are up. Like, what am I gonna do? Wake up all groggy and be like, oh, hell yeah, I'm just laying here. No, no. I feel like there should be booty call hour etiquette, you know? If I have not agreed to this conversation, don't get mad at me for not continuing it. Like, and then I messaged him the next morning like, hey, I just saw this because I just woke up because that's the truth. He's like, why didn't you message me when, you know, I sent it? I looked at the message. He sent that at 2 a.m. Now, even if it wasn't for a booty call, even if he was genuinely like having bad dreams and shit and he wanted me to talk to me, we ain't got it like that. I ain't waking up for you. My phone's on silent when I go to sleep. Like, like. People in my family can die and I won't find out until next morning because my phone is on silent. Um, but yeah, booty call hours just, nobody respects that anymore. And they're not getting the vibes from the people. Do I send out the, I'm ready for some dick at 2 a.m. like vibes? No, I'm not. No. Yeah, booty call hour, that's gonna be a whole video because I think we need to revisit that etiquette because I don't think everyone's on board with it anymore. Because that shit... That shit was popping when my mom was a club rat. The booty call hour, like you leave the club, after you give someone your phone number, you wait an hour or so, they hit you up asking if you're trying to link, bam. And that's usually what, around two? You know what? Booty call hour etiquette, that's gonna be a video. Anyway, I hope y'all have a good morning. I'm having a great morning for now. You wanna see out my window? Look, this is what I see every morning. This is what I see. Usually there's some beavers over there, but no beavers today. Anyway, y'all, I'm going to get ready and head to work. Have a marvelous morning. And don't text people late at night unless y'all have confirmed that you're booty call ready. <laughs>